what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this buffing wheel and it should be turning this way. I'm using the wrong side of the buffer, but I don't have any room. This is what happens to a backyard mechanic. But I got my glasses on and I'm going to plug this in. And right now I have mothers already on there, but not a fresh load of it. But I'm going to put mothers first and just see what happens. And right away, good stuff. It's getting shinier and shinier. I'm going to put some of this on here. It says use sparingly, so that's what I'm going to do. The white is for the best shine. Is that coming out nice? I'm putting a little time getting around the edges. I'm going to get into the cutouts on top for the velvet cutouts. Look at that. It still needs a lot more work. This is my first time ever using the buffing wheel, so I'm going crazy today and enjoying myself. But I want my pistons totally shiny. I want mirror finish on top of the pistons. Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fastest of us all? It's hard to get in those felt pockets, it's really difficult. You really can't get it in there all the way. It was good to try different angles and do the best you can. Then the rest has to be done with your hands. Just polishing it with a rag. Oh, wow. Man, is this really nice. Another thing I found out about these cast pistons is after, or these are forged, but my cast pistons, after they're polished, didn't have a perfect smooth surface. They were wavy, no matter how much I polished them. And this is a forged piston, and look at the shine. I don't know if you can see it, but look at that shine. It's unbelievable, beautiful shine, and it didn't take long at all. The cast piston, no matter what I did, and a couple hours shining on it, I just couldn't get it shiny. It didn't have that surface. There was a lot of metallic damage inside with the cast. So the forged pistons are made of rolled aluminum. And then it's pounded inside the forge and it gives a perfect metallic structure, really compact, 
And that's one reason I'm getting this good shine. What I'm doing is the final polishing on this piston crowns. And I want these to be mirror finish with no smudges, no oil spots, nothing. I want these to be totally polished. Right now I'm doing two and three. I've already done one and two. But this is real important right now to get this totally clean because you want anything on here to be reflected off, any kind of heat in the combustion chamber, you want a real good reflection. And a mirror finish is going to reflect a lot better than a dirty and a smudged. Now I just got through using this Mother's. This works better than anything I've ever seen. This is the energy release of polishes. This is the best polish I've ever seen. But I used that on here already, and these things are really shiny. They're real shiny.